Claude, are you ready for the aquarium field trip? The aquarium? Really? Sounds fun. But Mrs. Jules, I don't have any swimming gear, and I'm not sure why I'd need it at an aquarium anyway. Don't worry, Todd. We have extra diving suits. All you really need is your permission slip. What permission slip? The ones I distributed yesterday after I sent you home on the kindergarten bus. Don't tell me you don't have yours. No, I don't. Can I run home and get one signed before the bus leaves for the aquarium? Bus? <laughs> on a wayside field trip, students don't go to the aquarium. The aquarium comes to us. Okay, Lewis. Send in the fish. You got it, Mrs. J. Hmm, let's see. Dinosaurs, solar system. Ah, aquarium! Cool. We're going to be inside an aquarium? No, Todd. We are going to be inside an aquarium. You are going to be inside a dinghy where all the kids go who don't have a permission slip. Ready for the most amazing day ever, class. Yay! Todd, you look so lonely all alone in that lonely raft. Wouldn't it be nice to have some company? Um, I'll be okay. Avert your eyes, Todd. No incredible undersea adventure for you. You don't have a permission slip, remember? Oh, no. I don't have a permission slip either, Mrs. Jules. Yes, you do, Mauricia. I just saw it in your hand. What happened? Um, I accidentally ate it. Oh, dear. Well, you shouldn't go in the water right after eating. I'm afraid you'll have to spend the day in the dinghy with Todd. No! Oh, Todd. What will we ever do? Just the two of us trapped together in the middle of nowhere. We're not exactly in the middle of nowhere. We're in the middle of Mrs. Jewel's class, in a lifeboat. This isn't a lifeboat, it's a love boat. Why don't we hold hands Ow. and drop anchor over by that romantic private island? First of all, that's not an island. It's a filing cabinet. And secondly, holding hands is death. Shh, don't speak, Mon Capitan. The whales are serenading us. Oh! Field trip days and no kid day and no kid days a field trip day a field trip days and no kid day and that is a okay and those special fish I ordered should keep the thirtieth floor busy while I take my own field trip. Hmm. This aquarium thing is boring. How can you say that? We're exploring a rich ecosystem. Weren't you impressed by the seaweed growing on the rubber boot rack? Meh. All right, I was going to save the good stuff for later, but let's explore the dangers of the deep. Hold on to your helmet, Myron. Ooh, it says here that these pink periwinkle clams can open their mouths once every 103 years. Isn't that exciting? Boring. This is a gray fish. Did you know there are only 256 different kinds of gray fish? Wouldn't it be fun to count them all? Boring. Wow, a sea sponge. These wild fellas never, ever move. Let's watch. Boring. Myron, you're upsetting the ecosystem. I want to see a shark. Todd, can we hold hands now, huh? No. Oh. Then 
Then can you do me a favor and hand me that paddle? That's not a paddle. That's your hand. Oh, is it? <laughs> Silly me. <laughs> um, Todd, can you do me a favor and hand me that rope instead? That's not a rope. That's your hand. Oh, is it? <laughs> Silly me. <laughs> um, Todd, can you do me a favor and hand me my hand? That's not your hand. It's your hand. Who made you go? White dove must be love. Stamp it, lock it, no erases. Oh, Todd! You sent me a message in a bottle? How romantic! S-O-S. What's that, Todd? Some kind of secret love code? Actually, it's an international distress signal used by sailors. Oh, I get it. S-O-S, as in sweet on schoolmate. You really are a true romantic, Todd. Look, Myron. It's called a sea sludge, and it lives in gravel at the bottom of the ocean, where it eats gravel. That's so neat. Ugh. When are we going to see something really cool? Hey, how about... Glow guppies? They shouldn't be in here. Hmm, I remember reading something about those fish. Oh, I remember. They're boring. No, that's not it. Sorry, guy. If you're looking to bore me, you're a little late. <laughs> that's it. What do we do? We're being attacked by glow guppies! This wasn't in the job description. Well, Mrs. Bools. That's Jules. You certainly have the credentials, Mrs. Drools. Jules. But, Mrs. Mules, do you know how to handle an attack of glow guppies? Hmm, I guess it was in the job description. Now, what was that drill? Oh, right, same as the swamp creature drill. Run away! Oh, I mean, swim away! <laughs> this never would have happened if we just swam with the sharks. <laughs> Look, Mauricia, we need to help. <laughs> what? They look like they're having the time of their lives. I know I am. Want to hold hands yet? No. Mrs. Jules, can we help? You don't have a permission slip, Todd. That means you don't have permission to help us. Somebody else, help us! A permission slip. Don't worry, Mrs. Jules. Help is on the way. <laughs> Mauricia, uh, can you help me a second? I need to reach that permission slip. You can have my permission slip if you want. Uh, no thanks. I just need to lean out and grab that slip. So, could you... Would you... Hold my hand? <gasps> Hold your hand? Why didn't you say so? I would love to. Time to flip. Hey, where'd the sun go? Nice glow guppies. <laughs> Got it. Oh, Todd, how sweet. Even after all that, we're still holding hands. Oh, I just want this moment to last forever, Todd. It feels like I'm giving you goosebumps on your hand. Mauricia? Ah! Well, Todd, thank you for saving the class, and I'm glad you finally found your permission slip. It's not signed. I can't accept this. 
You didn't have permission to save us. And for that, I'm sending you home early on the kindergarten bus. But technically, I didn't save the class. I was just trying to get away from Mauricia. Ready when you are, Mon Capitan. Sorry, Todd, but you'll just have to accept that you're the biggest hero in the history of Wayside and take your punishment for it like the troublemaker you are. Ow! <laughs> Swamp creature drill. And I remember this one. Run! Field trip day, field trip day. Oh, how I hate field trip day. Ouch! 